my speech today is Hello, Toastmasters. Good evening. My speech today is titled Life is Hard. And it's about how to live a great life despite the fact that life is hard. Everybody wants to have a, to live, to have a good life. You want a perfect life. You want to have great kids. You want to have you want to be married to Mr. Right or to Mrs. Perfect. You want to have friends that stick by us, come rain or shine. You want to have all the material good things in life. You want a life we don't have, we don't want problems, we want a life with no problems. Everybody wishes for a happy life, but the definition of some time, definition of a great life might differ from one person to another. For example, for one person, a great life is having three minutes in a day and having a roof over their head. For another person, a great life is having a huge mansion and a couple of million dollars in the bank. But at the bottom line, we found that a great life is a life free of stress. We don't, we don't want stress. Life is difficult. Nothing comes really easy in life. You have to put some effort to get anything you want. Unless you win the lottery. And if you win the lottery, you still have to go out and buy the ticket to play. And besides that, life is difficult in the case that your kids might not be the children, might not be what you might not behave the way you want them to behave. Or maybe your home is not the, the place you want it to be. Even at work, you can have your work, you can you might have your work made, play some foolish things sometimes. Or maybe your boss, not the nicest person you want. And even your job sometimes might bring some challenges you do not expect to have. But Nevertheless, once you understand and once you know that life is difficult or hard and accept it, then it can get much better. Once you do understand that, you find that the situation you find yourself in is not just for you alone, it's like it's a normal routine for every human being. That's why you live, you have that issue. You find that you are not just, you're just like anybody else. You also find that you're not just Mr. or Mrs. Perfect, that you can make mistakes. But I don't want to stop there. Even though you accept that life is hard or life is difficult and all that comes around it, you also have to not just accept it and stay in that condition and go with the flow. No, you have to change. You have to say, no, no, no. I have to move on. Like this story has like two points. Like one side will tell you that one life is hard, the other side will tell you that you can make it better. And that's where I want to go. You can make it better because you are responsible. You have the responsibility to make your life better. For example, to say that if life hands you lemon, make lemonade. So go with that and work harder. You are responsible for everything in your life. You can make it better. For example, you can become a better employee, work harder for the promotion you want to have. You can also work better, learn how to raise great kids or become a the perfect husband or, or wife you want your spouse to be. Just be good and it makes it much easier. You see that you're the only person that controls yourself. You have control over yourself. No boss is going to do it for you. It's you. So you have to work on that. And you have to make choices for that. Everything has choices. So you have, you have to make your choices to move on. And no matter what situation you find yourself in, you have choices. No matter how bad things are, you have a choice. And no matter what you think you can, you cannot do this, you still have a choice to make and move on. The choice might not be easy, as you said. 
it might be a very, very difficult choice. And the road to, for that decision might be very, very rough. It may push you out of your way, of your comfort zone. It may mean that the initial period of your life may get even harder and harder than it already is. But you have made the choice and you move on with that. A lot of time, you will find that the choices are not as hard as you thought they might be. You may have just shut off your mind from seeing those choices and possibilities and because you thought you had no choice. Once you become open to the idea that you are responsible for your life and that you have choices, you will find that you are no longer stuck just because life is hard. So the final point is that life is hard but you have to finance it. But life becomes more needful and more purposeful when you learn how to make choices and move on with that.